Good evening, everyone. Thursday night. Hopefully, if you're in the Midwest, or at least in Iowa, Wisconsin, you're dodging the uh, severe weather. It looks like it's north of us now, so earlier today was a little dicey at times. But uh, anyway, that's the time of season we are in. So we are getting ready to do the 2021 Bowman One Case Hobby that ended on uh, eBay last night, so do appreciate everyone on that taking care of invoices and all. Uh, we are 100% paid on this break. As always, um, especially with the Bowman 2021, there seems to be more, or there is more uh, auto-only spots. So as always, we do credit back um, shipping, and then we do try to help out a little bit if we can either with a coupon for a future or a little bit percent off. Um, so be on the lookout for that. So as for shipping, even with it being the holiday, we should get this shipped out um, still normal, hopefully uh, in the mail. But I guess it won't mail won't go out till Tuesday, but we at least like to have it um, ready to go by Sunday. So that's the reason why we always break on Thursdays. So without further ado, we will uh maze the team was uh the last break so that was the last video this one is not this is a player break so um anyway without further ado we'll get started here open this case up for those of you that are new I'll explain a few rules for those of you that uh, join us for most of the time this will just be the regurgitation of what you're used to so as always, all Chrome cards, rookie cards, will be, and I guess uh, the Chrome parallels will be sleeved or top-loaded before sorting. Just don't do that on the, on the camera, just for the sake of time. All um, numbered parallels, along with autos, will be top-loaded. Also, the Atomic, which will be one per hobby will be uh off the top load that even though it's not numbered it's just a it's a box hit of course two atomics per jumbo box one in the uh hobby on the uh, pipelines those will be split up evenly to the players that have breaks we have been trying to scrub those just to make sure that uh if that was the only card that we got those out of there if we do hit a parallel that will be randomed at the end I think that's about all. I think you guys are ready to see some cards. So, hobbies so far for us on have been, I would say, the overall better of the cases. Um, we've pulled, uh, I would say, our our bigger hits or our nicer hits with a couple gold shimmers. Uh, two weeks ago, the the case that we had, we were hitting way ahead of the odds. If we're not um, I would say hitting the, the big players. So, of course, looking for orange or better in the chromes. Dil Dylan Carlson, Rookie of the Year favorites. Langoliers and Bishop on the chromes. Orange or better. We have seen a, a red prospect. Have not seen a red auto. So always looking for that. This year, a little bit tougher on the odds. Last year, it took all the way to Bowman Draft to get our first one. So Pipeline, Giants, Detmers, and Terang on the Chromes, Dingler and Gray on the Paper. Next week, we do have a one-case jumbo, um, and then the following week, we will get into um, more of uh, one more jumbo case, and then some finest, and be rolling into the top series, too. So we are going to try, I think we've been, had several people ask if we would try a two-case um, uh, team break on top so we are going to try that i do believe i think we have it uh we have the product coming and, and so we'll try that so neon green detmers 
numbered to 399. Two thirteen of three ninety nine. Again, we will do a recap at the end. No need to send a message on shipping, or if you do go hitless uh, at the time of shipping, I do send those out along with a message. So just to give you a heads up. So Bobby Witt on the retro. Simeon Woods. Had almost every parallel or the rainbow started on him last week. So last week, or so, so far the gold shimmer Acosta or the blaze has been the, say our best hits. Rodriguez and Callahan on the chromes. Atis on the retro. Gray and Alcantara on the chromes. And looks like a mint or green mini diamond coming up for the prospects. Dodgers pipeline. Alvarez on the Chrome and Minnesota Tavaco. Two other nice choices for the Twins. So Cavaco on the Mini Diamond or Mini Green Diamond. We we have seen one yellow so far this year, but uh, I've seen these almost uh, most of our breaks. Fourteen of ninety nine. Of course, this is the only green version of the parallel in the hobby. All other green are only available in the retail. Sam Huff on the top 100. Jordan Walker, Diaz on the chromes. And that is our auto. So I think that's our auto. So it is a retro. Yeah, that's the retro. Maybe not an auto, but nice hit for the Wander Franco. 35 of 50 for the gold on the retro. There's an Austin Martin paper. So we have actually pulled a couple of this version of Wander Franco. Did not pull a gold, but thought that could have been possibly a rookie auto on where it was at. But 35 of 50 for the Wander Franco. When will we be celebrating his call up? Evan White on the Rookie of the Year favorites. Casas and Tucker on the Chromes. Corbin Carroll, Futurist. Mauricio, Bobby Witt on the Chromes. Brady Singer on the top 100. Manning and Gilbert on the Chromes. Still looking for our first auto. So we have gone six and six on the numbered versus um, parallel or numbered versus uh, base. Hunter Green, Wells on the Chrome. Can definitely tell uh, a little bit of scattered brain. 
for regular work. Memorial Day is a busy holiday, so. Rookie of the Year favorites, Joe Adele, Ramos, and Pagiro on the Chromes. And there's a Atomic. That is a auto. Angel Martinez. So our first auto is a Atomic. 62 of 100 on that one. Nick Gonzalez, Hancock on the Chromes. Here we go. Nice Atomic. Haven't seen an Atomic. Didn't see one last week. We only saw we saw two our first week, but uh, sixty-two of one hundred. The Angel Martinez. All right, there's our auto. Of the first, always hoping for an orange in hobby. Chisholm on the top one hundred. Morel Power on the Chromes. Luciano on the Futurist, Torkelson, Hosey, the Chromes. So we did learn one thing about uh, Torkelson last week because we did break some retail. So Torkelson Chrome has been a has been a redemption, but his paper, which we did pull last week, is signed. So Bruhan and Ivan Johnson on the Chrome. Of course, uh, we all know who the uh, big name is. That's a redemption. But Torkelson also, along with Alex Bohm, because we did pull two Rookie of the Year favorites back-to-back -back on Alex Bohm. So Pink Fuchsia coming up, and it is a veteran San Francisco, Mike Yastrzemski. Side down. And our Atomic for this box Busan. So again, Hobby this year, or same as last year, one Atomic per. Last year they were not available in the Jumbos. This year Jumbos are available too. But I think we've already seen what happens is the value has kind of gone down a little bit on those or what they were it's because of the availability so pink fuchsia 154 of 299 for the mike yastrzemski Let's see do a little shuffling okay last few packs box number one Pache, Rookie, the Retro, Jonathan India, Volp on the Chromes, Xavier Edwards on the Positional Promise, Pink Fuchsia Shimmer coming up, Arizona, Perdomo. Just got his, uh, just got a purple in our retail player break, or team break. Now the pink, or fuchsia shimmer, numbered 177 of 199. How's it going, Jason? Good timing. I don't know if you watched the team break, but you did get a, a Perdomo uh, purple in that. I think you had Arizona. Nate Pearson on the top 100. Usan and Zamora on the chrome. So that is box number one.
On to box number two. Joey Bart, Rookie of the Year favorites. Henderson, Severino on the Chromes. And that looks like that's our auto, so base auto. Cincinnati, Mac Wainwright. So, haven't seen him in a couple weeks, but uh, that is one of the auto-only spots. And Antonio Gomez on the sky blue paper on the back. 482 of 499 <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, we have not seen a nugget yet. Have not seen a buyback yet, which those are pretty tough to hit. Um, so, have not seen a red, have not seen a super. So, we might as well just go down the list. But uh, there's a base. So, we are one base to one numbered auto. Anderson, top 100, Rutledge and Gilbert on the Chrome. So now getting the, the auto that early, got a long way to go. So hopefully we run into a couple nice parallels. Corkelson on the Futurist, Larnick and Lodolo. So look, Larnick is... Uh, Doing extremely well on his call up. Bellinger on the retro. Jeter Downs, Cavaco on the chromes. Rockies on the pipeline. Pena Duran on the chromes. Asa Lacey, top 100. Beater and Reyes on the chromes. Um, Brandon, I think the shimmers are retail. Um, I could be wrong, but I, I'm, I know we pulled a green shimmer last weekend on the retail break that we did a case last week. Um, I don't, yeah, I don't think in here I'm for, I know we, I don't, if there is, we have not seen one. So now you got me thinking if that was a. Nate Pearson, Rookie of the Year favorites. Talia, Libertor on the Chromes. No Nolan Ryan. I would like to see that a Nolan Ryan or any of the buybacks. Again, those are a uh, pretty tough hit, but uh, if you hit one, they are a pretty nice hit. Riley Green, I've seen him posted and looked at him. Looked pretty cool. Alvarez on the 
Shoemake and Martin on the Chrome. So yeah, Brandon. I mean, I, I mean, I, I will admit fully if I'm wrong and I don't say or think that I know. But I, I do think that um, the Shimmer is only available in retail. The only thing in hobby that's green that's available is the mini diamond. So Nolan Jones and then a Spackle. Cincinnati, Ivan Johnson. Number 250 of 299. First couple weeks of our breaks, Ivan Johnson seemed to uh, come up there for the auto title. Haven't seen his auto in a while. Since. And 250 of 299. I like how they... Uh, in the shimmers and the spackles, they the numbers pretty high, hidden this year. Overall, it's going to be a fun product to chase, just because you know the Bowman Chrome will all be, of course, with the silver this year. Though it does, it's going to show a lot more uh, surface defects than what uh, the other, last year was. But Thomas and Bitsko, again, I do try to point those out when I see them. Probably look at these cards under a lot more light than most. So, Perdomo on the top 100. Kelly and Cavalli on the chromes. Again, all chromes and all chrome inserts. You get top up sleeve before we sort. So, don't try to, we don't touch them anymore. So, our atomic coming up for this box. X Mayor on the Chrome first, and Bobby Miller. The Atomic. Yeah, yep, you're right on that. Yeah, those are 99s. Yep. And I, I, I'm I, pretty sure that we did pull a green shimmer last week in our case. Mackenzie Gore, Romo, and Gomez on the chromes. I think in the retail... Um, on the retail 24 packs that we broke last week, I think the green, the shimmer and the green auto was more or less a case hit. Nick Lodolo on the positional promise. Marsh and Robinson. So one thing, Brandon, you can do in our in our description, we do uh, I do put the link to uh, group breakers. And if you go on there and download um, that checklist, that checklist will not include retail. So that could answer that question too for you. On if on what you're uh, on that at least on the hobby side, because that those lists do not list on the retail. Well, they they do, but it's a different way. It's not in the normal Excel on the Excel. Uh, uh, player and team. So, how's it going, Jim? Good luck. Jason Dominguez on the Futurist. Freeman and Chatham on the Chrome. So, on that, if anybody ever wants a um, was wondering what players or what they have. Um, we do put now going forward in our description a link to a pretty good website that has, and especially if you're familiar and comfortable using Excel, um, it, you can download the checklist and then sort in Excel to your player, to your team, and know exactly what hits you are. Um, so
Thompson and Hall. Last or last few packs here, box number two. Ryan Mountcastle on the top 100. Vaughn and Allen. Mike, after I do this, we'll uh, I'll I'll catch everybody up to speed here at least on the on what we've gotten for parallels along with a couple autos in the first couple boxes. So yeah, not too late, just a couple boxes in. York and Peraza. We do do a recap at the end, so anytime you ever just want to fast forward, not listen to me can uh, do that find out your hits there so asa lacy on the retro espino and frank or franco on the chrome so real quick just to catch the so we're we're one one base auto mac wainwright and then one numbered atomic martinez and then as for our chrome parallels a mini diamond cavaco Perdomo and Ivan Johnson. And we did get the uh, gold. <laughs> yeah, you can't fast forward until at the end, unfortunately. Man, wouldn't that be wouldn't that be cool though? We could go into the future for about two hours just to see what we're gonna end up with. see that even when we're I can say so far my uh the breaks I've joined in the Bowman uh haven't been uh I would say very uh lucrative I would say maybe all right here we go box number three Detroit Tigers pipeline, Jeter Downs, Pena on the Chromes. It's an Austin Martin paper. I think that was our that's our second. Well then, see, maybe maybe you should leave for a couple more boxes, Mike. Maybe that uh Brandon Marsh. Duran, De La Rosa on the Chromes. I can say that uh, we can have our, our superstitions just like uh, most of these players that we chase down have. Beater and Sabato on the Chromes. There should be Austin Martin Chrome here. Sequencing is correct. Rookie of the Year favorites, Madrigal. There is Austin Martin. Josh Young. So Sabato and Austin Martin go back to back, usually. No, Jim. I I actually normally we start at six. We did a uh, we did a quick uh, a ten ten box blaster. So started a little bit earlier at five fifteen tonight or five thirty, and then just forty five minute window for that. So futurist on the Mick Abel. We got a yellow chrome parallel. Larnick in San Francisco. Patrick Bailey. Pretty cool looking card. Yeah, the uh, I'll tell you what. Last week, uh, uh, Simeon, gosh, he had four or five different parallels. 65 of 75 on the yellow chrome.
Just trying to work with your superstitions. I'm showing late and get a hit, so. I've already seen a couple, I haven't seen a yellow in a while either, along with an atomic auto, so I nice see different colors come up. We're still looking for orange. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of like uh, being a Cardinals fan too. The uh, the catchers that uh, have been behind Molina, I think some of them, and you know, and Kitzner, I don't think is the one of the future. Henderson and Gore. And so it looks like a, another auto. And it looks like a refractor auto. Colorado, Montana. 332 of 499. Lede and Batty on the chromes. Yeah. You know how many teams in the past the catchers would start uh, going elsewhere as they aged. Three thirty-two of four ninety-nine. Oh, well, we are Eric. We are definitely kind of kind of trying to find our way very slowly the last week, but you know that's why we follow this game. One hundred sixty-two games. It's pretty good that uh, each team is going to lose 50 games. It's what they do with the remaining 62 is kind of what separates them. Always going to have slumps and highs and lows. So. First ad on the Futurist, Espino and Garrett Mitchell. Yeah, the, the bullpen is really showing that uh, O'Neill Cruz, top 100. Hendrick and Kalenic on the Chromes. Of course, the back end is strong, and then the, it's just getting to the back end. Is, it's just been brutal at times. Blaze Jordan on the Futurist. Vogel and Freeman on the Chromes. Yeah, and I mean Herrera. I I know. I think he started out pretty well. Um. So, yeah, that's the thing with kids. Uh, Kinsner is he's not. I don't. He's not the chosen future. Or the the rain. It's kind of like uh you know Matheny, and then it. Uh, Molina was groomed for a year. <clears throat> Belzovich and Thompson on the chromes. So since they are opening up the ballparks around here, we we live uh, we live forty five minutes between to two different uh, high A ballparks. So Peoria is just down the road. Or I guess Peoria will play in the Quad Cities, which is down the road. There's still the Cardinal High A. So. I didn't actually. I read some of it. I didn't listen to it. But Andrew Vaughn had a huge home run the other night. Nick York. So again, Andrew Vaughn may be somebody that will show up and update. I don't think they will get him. Maybe they will even get him in Series 2. It just seems like yesterday that we were chasing his uh, draft. So Casey Mize, Retro, Peraza, Davidson.
Yeah, Mike, I agree. And, and you know, your dang Reds, every year they start out like they do, and, and then they just they, they can't can't keep up with in a yeah in a in a horrible division. Max Mayer, Futurist, Alex Thomas, JJ Blade on the Refractor, three thirty nine of four ninety nine. I know Jason, there he is. I knew he would speak up. Three thirty-two of four ninety-nine. You know what? Uh, we have not seen much on uh, wit on the lines of parallels. There's there's been a few guys that on parallels we just haven't seen, and then there's just a few guys it seems we get them all the time. And you know when it comes to their numbers, the numbered parallels, you know everybody has the same number. So <laughs> Bitsko Rodriguez on the Chrome. And looks like a yellow. And it is a Josh Bell. So threw me off upside down there. Saw the bat. Jared Kelly on the chrome. And then Taylor Trammell on the atomic. There's a blaze. So series two going to be coming out. Um, you know, series two probably be a pretty fun. A um, lot more we've been seeing the introduction through inception and and heritage of just who's who's going to be in series two. Who will fall in series two and then push to update? It will be interesting. So I think probably Kalenic will be update. So sixty four seventy five. So this year. Um, it's, uh, shaping up to be pretty consistent, at least group or decent, uh, rookie group in each release, but who knows? Ops only knows who. Like I said, in Series 2, we are going to, Mayor and Diaz on the Chromes, we are going to do a two case team break just to see how that goes we've had a few messages on asking and we do two case player format so positional promise romo and marsh on the chrome Young on the top 100, Robinson and Choi on the Chromes. All right, on to box number four. I'm going to open from the left side. Last three boxes we've got in our auto pretty early from the right side. All right. Well, it's nice to have Eric in here, another Cardinals fan. Normally, I'm way outnumbered. Joey, Joey hasn't been around in a while, so but he's our he's my the only other Cardinal fan that usually comes in. Talia and Lynch. Of course, I am a Cardinals fan, but uh, love baseball so. Probably, and I'm blessed because I have a wife that enjoys it also. So she is the one that does majority of our sorting. So that tells you there her Dahlquist and Luciano.
Yeah, Jim, you know, you know, and that's the thing is, you know, we we have uh, so it was the Astros, Mariners, um, the Cardinals. I can't remember what the Colonels were, but we've had we had five of them. Libertor on the uh, Atomic, but uh, we've been blessed. I mean, we did lose two of the ballparks with the change, but you know, we we lived within a hour of five different a ball and it's just a fun good experience especially after draft time so there is my favorite card of this I'm sure they photoshopped that baseball in there but it's still pretty cool Luis Robert on the Retro Perdomo and Cruz. I always tell the story that uh, my son, when he was his first baseball game, he would have been um, about 17 months old. And uh, he actually, um, the Clinton affiliate was playing the uh, Snappers, which was Brewers at the time. And Walston and Nova and Prince Fielder and a whole few other were playing. Uh, Tony Gwynn Jr., uh, Galeg, I think it was Galegos, or, um, but they actually took him out on the field and played catch with him. Um, they all signed his ball. I, I think he probably had 15 or 20 different autos on that. But 266 of 299. I'm I'm not for sure anymore, Mike, because they ch they all changed with the reorg. Corbin Carroll on the top 100, Drew Waters and Mana on the. And there's another Drew Waters paper. Nick Gonzalez on the Futurist, Westberg and Arias on the Chrome. I almost want to say the Burlington Bees were the last angels, but I, like I said, I could be wrong. Zach Veen and Maiden are much, uh, be definitely wrong on that. I know they they changed. I'm originally from Clinton, which we had the uh, the Mariners affiliate for the longest time. Phillies, Lacey and Velade uh, on the Chromes. Hunter Green on the top 100, Ramirez and Xavier Edwards on the Chrome. And here comes our first orange, so orange prospect parallel coming up. Looks like a true orange, not a shimmer. First is Royce Lewis and Milwaukee. Could be a couple good names. Feliciano. Five of 25 on that. So that is our first orange sighting. Like to see an auto. I'll usually get a paper also. Five of twenty-five on that. So uh actually we did go to the last time that they held a all-star game, and it was when the Quad Cities actually was a Cardinal affiliate, but uh um that was when uh 
Kobe uh, Rasmus was uh, playing. He won the home run derby, but uh, I caught his uh, his foul ball, so just kind of cool. We actually were just down at the Cardinals game a couple weeks ago, Mother's Day actually, and my father-in-law caught a foul ball from uh, Tommy Edmond. So. Casey Mize, Rookie of the Year favorites. There's a Blaze Chrome. Montero on the Chrome. Good luck tonight, Jeremy, on Blaze and Austin. I haven't, uh, we've, we've been pretty lucky, or uh, we've seen quite a bit of Blaze, and there we go, that snuck up on me. Um... But uh, Encarnacion on the base auto. We are two base and two numbered so far. I've not seen uh, an Austin Martin on not even a parallel, so... And that is a base auto. Sean Murphy, Rosario and Vavra. So I don't know if any of you have been to a game, a major league game with the uh, the seating the way it is. I can say it's uh, it is nice as a fan to. It kind of made you made us feel like we were at a minor league park just because you didn't have to get up and constantly move for people. Kind of could just sit and relax and spread out. And... Well, Arrows Arena, you know why? You know why he was. Uh, let go because he called out Schilt. Um, you know, well, it seems like he he kind of started slow this year. Howard and Gorman on the Chromes, so but he's definitely coming back around. Um, uh, no, Kevin, no Dominguez, just a regular Chrome and base. Yeah, void. I don't. I don't think. I mean, we didn't let. I mean, wasn't didn't we get? Uh, we got decent back on void, but I don't know. We'll we'll still see on Airs Arena. I mean, if Libertor actually comes through, I mean, but still, when you look at the offense of the Cardinals, I mean, Airs Arena would really look nice in there, especially now. So, Dominguez. Speaking of Dax Fulton. I will, I will tell you though, Eric. I I uh, Lofton and Maya. So I was looking through some older stuff, and I came across an Ares Arena. So Ares Arena. I don't know if anybody's really paid attention to Ares Arena's auto, but he always has the uh, that. Um, if anybody can, if you Google his or look at his. Uh, 2020 series two he had a silver pack chrome and actually in the background is a guy in the stands and it perfectly lines up that he put that nose and eyes on the the fan in the stands and i saw that never i just thought he was doing a joke there but his that's his signature so one of my favorite signatures Yeah, O'Neal, I, you know, Feliciano Carroll on the Chromes. Bader, um, I, I think I, I'm giving up, or I've given up on Bader. 
O'Neill, I actually saw play in Clinton. Um, he was part of the Seattle. Um, Jeter Downs, Jarvis and Stott actually have used to have a program of him playing. Didn't even, and then when the Cardinals picked him, I was like, wait a minute. Last pack of box number four. Here's an Acosta. Got the Acosta Gold Shimmer last week. Hassel. Yeah, uh, Tyler O'Neill, yeah, came up through Seattle. Yeah, I think he was starting to come into his own. I, I mean, I think he still can and will. Edmund has kind of taken on my favorites. Um, I like him and actually O'Neill right now, so... Boy, have I shed a lot of tears, though, in 20, 2019 update. A lot of breaks chasing Edmund. We have a lot of base rookies. <laughs> uh, Austin Hendrick on the Futurist. Arius, and there's our second refractor, Cavaco. So we, we got the... Uh, the uh, mini green diamond Cavaco earlier. So now I'll add to it a refractor. Four thirteen of four ninety nine. Cool. So yeah, I, I mean, it's definitely, definitely fun if you have the, I know in Clinton now they have an independent uh, team there. Um, in the Quad Cities, they're, they're getting ready to open up um, for fans there. Zach Veen and Diaz, I think it's next week, I think. A's pipeline again a, the pipelines we do split them up evenly and it does go there's not all the players are listed so obviously it uh, some of them may go to just one player some of them may go to two and then I think there's only one that goes to split up three ways Gavin Lux on the top 100 Ramirez and Choi on the chrome Let's see if we can get a nice auto. We did get the atomic. Um, let's see if we can get a nice color. Two and two for base to color right now, or numbered at least. Royce Lewis and Cabrera on the chromes. Wander Franco got the gold version of that. Feliciano and Beard on the Chromes. Emerson Hancock on the Futurist. Lynch and Dahlquist on the Chromes. Drew Waters on the top 100, Soderstrom and Pete Crow on the Chromes. It looks like our Ari Tomic. Is, oh, there's a the neon green upside down. Pete Alonzo, Perdomo, and Detroit Tigers, Adinzo Reyes on the Atomic. So that paper hit has been upside down. 
interesting on how that works, and it's usually consistent. 322 of 399. So the other thing that seems pretty consistent on our paper parallels is when you hit a veteran, more times than not, you're going to hit them all the way through. Or if you hit a rookie, there may just be a coincidence, but uh, that seems to be how our, what we've seen now on our seventh case of Bowman. Nate Pearson on the retro, Walston and Beer on the chrome. Andrew Vaughn, Positional Promise, Nova and Drew Waters on the Chromes. Lizardo, Top 100, Westberg and Rodriguez on the Chrome. <laughs> oh man, can, I I think the poor guy's arm would fall off if he could try to pitch. But yeah, he's uh, definitely Carol and Jarvis. The the thing I like about him is it kind of brings back a little bit of the Cardinals on how they were when I was growing up. You know, Vince Coleman, Willie McGee, Ozzy Smith, just kind of that uh, speed and 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 hit. You know, Edmund is more of a Line drive or a slap hit, Acosta and Groshans. And that's what I was, uh, that's why, oh, of course, I I grew up playing Pee Wee baseball and minors and majors and pony as the Cardinals, but that's probably why I grew up a Cardinals fan. Orioles, Tenna and Dominguez on the Chrome. Roshans on the top 100. Lofton and Isaiah Green on the Chromes. It looks like a blue paper prospect on the back here. Amaya and Whitley. And Colorado, Talia. So we just got the Talia. Uh, we got a tally of something. Maybe it was another paper, but uh, just a heads up here on the uh, corner there. See the little bit of white. Other than that, the other corners look pretty good. 59 of 150. Paper. Still looking for our auto, should be coming up here. Jimenez, Rookie of the Year favorites, Cabrera and Salas. Salas is one of those that seems to be a case hit for us. Lacey on the Futurist, Abel and Ed Howard on the Chromes. I might have placed a, yeah, there we go. Placed the auto in the wrong stack here. And, nope. Soto on the Retro, 
Riley Green, Mackenzie Gore on the Chromes. And there we go. So an Atomic Top 100. Not a auto, but a nice uh, parallel for the Spencer Torkelson. Another Blaze Chrome. The Atomic Bowman's Top 100 Scouts. Spencer Torkelson. These are numbered to 125. So that is our, our 150, 51 of 150. So that is our second insert parallel. Still looking for our auto Brian Mountcastle rookie of the year favorites Adams and Davidson on the chrome and there we go spackle auto coming up and it's Seattle Emerson Hancock, numbered 178 of 299. Dingler and Rosario on the Chromes. Our still our lowest was the Atomic to 100. So still hoping to get a gold, gold or orange, maybe one of both. Uh, Torque was 51 of 150, Mike. The last, last week, like I said, we did pull a paper pair or paper auto of him. So the unicorn that uh, we experienced from draft, uh, did show up. That was Torkelson. Zach Veen or and Jordan Walker. We didn't out of twelve cases of draft breaks. We didn't hit either of them. Jordan Walker. We didn't even hit a parallel. Uh, our first break this year, we hit two Zach Veen autos, and then we just hit the Corkelson uh, last week. Jordan Walker doesn't have an auto in this, so I still think he's the unicorn. So. Um, I do think in it, Mike, I do think in tops with the, the foils edition, um, I think they were a good addition, but also at the same time, Beater and Sabato on the Chrome. So we should have a Martin, but at the same time, it did take away from the normal, normally you'd get, uh, uh two or three blacks and, uh, you know, we didn't out of. Uh, 13 cases of of uh, series one and then two more cases of retail stuff we never saw a camel or a mother's day um, pink we saw father's day blue but so i think the foils you know they added those nice addition but also at the same time is you know hopefully they don't go down the road of trying to be panini That's just my personal preference. I mean, it's nice to have parallels in a, in a lot of things to chase, but at the same time, too, um, dilute and Talia and Lynch. Ruiz, top 100. Dahlquist and Manoa. Manoa looked Pretty darn good today on his debut.
Soderstrom and Perdomo, and then the neon green, Cleveland, Nolan Jones. 356 to 399, and we all know, you know, with the addition of the fuchsia, the neon green, um, you know, more parallels equals more print run. 356 to 399. Adley on the retro, Walston and Garcia on the chromes. And our Atomic coming up, Luciano, Batty, and Cavaco. So Cavaco also along with Talia having a little bit of a couple parallels coming through. Well, Mike, I wish it was all up to me, but uh, Rutledge and Diaz, it does work out when we hit always hit some but there's always going to be some that we don't hit definitely will take the thanks because we also get the other messages so looks like a aqua shimmer coming up aqua shimmer numbered 125 and there just said uh, somebody's creating a rainbow so there's a talia on the aqua shimmer that one's 52 of 125. Yeah, Cavaco and Italia, at least on the uh, parallels, I guess uh, that's a good thing if those are your spots. So. Congrats to those. See what we can do on the ones that haven't hit. Rodriguez, Lodolo, and Tucker on the Chromes. Positional Promise, Torkelson, Jeter Downs, and Pena. Erstad, Duran, and Cavalli on the Chrome. All right, on to the second stack that has had our auto. So still looking for something better than a hundred, and it looks like it's a refractor auto. So our second refractor auto. And Chicago, Riley Thompson, 287 of 499. Velade and Ramirez on the chromes. I mean, don't get me wrong. I mean, all I mean, tops or even Panini. I mean, they have their really nice parallels, and then some that just uh, <laughs> oh, Jason, you you have to be patient on my uh, sometimes long drawn out. Uh, responses to so and it's 
this hobby is uh, has so many different variations to opinions and everything else. So Cabrera, Feliciano, breakers are, as I say, are kind of turning into radio stations. You have to, if you don't like what they do, you know, there's no point of letting them know. It's, you know, just move on. Everybody has their own style. So the hobby is definitely uh, grown in many ways for good and for bad. I think uh, Hobby Legends said it best a couple weeks ago on one of the breaks. When it comes to picking a breaker, you kind of have to have it like a restaurant. You don't ever go just eat at one place. There's your favorite, and then there's some a few other places you enjoy. So three thirty nine or four ninety nine on the Brennan Davis. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Eric, that's a good one. So I live in, in Cub area. So Alec Thomas, Acosto, and Sanchez on the Chromes. Robert Hassel. And Blaze on the Chromes. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, I guess that's, you know, there probably are people that uh, watch me and say I put too much thumb on it, but. Uh, I guess that's just, uh, you know, I, I'm a collector in the hobby right along with everybody else. You know, when I'm not doing this, I, I'm working or guess what? I'm joining breaks. And so um, I treat the cards like I would, so I don't uh, intentionally do anything. Um, I want to, if somebody is wearing gloves, I don't hold it to, uh, against them i guess it's just their way of saying that they but when the camera's off it still comes down to what they do behind the scenes so westberg nick allen on the chrome Arias and Veen, I'll tell you, with the PS, PSA thing, ugh. I mean, it's already been um, a long wait, and now with the PSA, it, uh, Joe Adele on the Rookie of the Year favorites, Lacey and Franco. All right, that is at our halfway point, so we are at four numbered autos. We got two refractors, Montano, Thompson, Hancock on the Spackle, and Martinez on the Atomic. And then two base, Encarnacion and Mac Wainwright. So let's see if we can heat up the color. All right, here we go. Second half. Let's see if we can uh, get a few more numbered, but uh, lower numbered. Blaze Jordan, Futurist, Dingler, and Rosario. Uh, last week out of the two cases, we did not hit a rookie auto. Uh, two weeks prior to that, we were actually averaging uh, three rookie autos out of two cases. So... Again, not a guaranteed 
Garcia, Torkelson, and Cruz. It does seem um, whenever we hit a color rookie auto, we hit, that was when we hit a Mount Castle yellow and a Dylan, Dylan Carlson um, gold. So, Cardinals Pipeline, Posey and Brujan, or Brujan. Mayor on the top 100. So I, I do send in cards occasionally, but not to... It's more or less for my... Ooh, that's a that's really thin. Definitely missing some cards on this one. But um, it's more for my personal stuff. So, yeah, we're missing all of the uh, base and uh, base veterans or the on top. We're starting out with the uh, chrome. I mean, they, they probably get the cards of cardinal people that I send in. It's more or less just for me. Um, to slab them and just and, and to display them, but uh, they probably look at that saying, "Why is this guy sending in these?" It's just more for personal or just my preference. Poussin and uh, Maiton on the Chrome. Ooh, gold shimmer prospect coming up. Max Mayer. So we did get a orange already. So now a gold shimmer. Cincinnati. Hunter Green. A gold shimmer. 10 of 50 on that one. Yeah, and the way I understand Eric on the HGA though, they is they they accept it, then they turn it off. Accept it. Maybe that's just you know, maybe they once they, you know, like a restaurant. How many times have we sat and waited for a table for forty five minutes and there's a whole bunch of tables open? Well, it's because they only see it as they can they can uh cook, so Maybe that's the way that he, and, and I, if that's not a bad thing, I don't think, that they have standards that they want to try to get on, at least on the return, so. Jarvis and our Atomic, Jonathan India. Speaking of the Reds, Reds kind of stolen a few of the parallels here. Dylan Carlson, Acosta, and Young on the Chromes. Robinson on the Positional Promise. Hassel and Blaze on the Chrome. So I think that's our second Chrome blaze here in this actually in this stack i think crochet top 100 at uh, adams and luciano on the chromes all right let's get some nice uh, numbered low numbered on the autos Mick Abel on the Futurist, Simeon Woods and Mar or Mauricio on the Chrome.
Joe Adele on the retro, Bobby Witt and Montero on the chrome. I will say the one thing that I have noticed, at least on this year's Bowman, it seems centering is probably the biggest. And it's probably maybe more noticeable just because of the lines and the outline this year. Astros on the pipeline, Manning and Hunter Green on the Chromes. Okay, Wells and Vavra on the Chromes. There's a nice uh, front pack. Chisholm, Mize, Garcia, Cronenworth, and Camposano on the for rookies. Ramos, Gonzalez, nice sequencing there. Oh, yes. Yeah, Eric, that's the... Uh, so far, this case has been pretty decent, but I know Hancock and Gorman on the Chromes. I know a couple weeks ago it seemed like uh, everyone had roller marks, scratch marks, or something. We pulled a Blaze, um, a Blaze base that was just, I mean, just tore up at the top. It, it just had the streaks all at the top. Trammel and Baz on the Chromes. Still looking for our auto. But with all the silver, that's you're going to see that more. Alex Bone, like I said, Langoliers and Edwards. You know, I I look through or look at the card, so I, that's why I call it out, just because I have a lot of lighting. I was joking last week, our neighbors that live behind us, they always know when I'm recording because they say if our bottom window at our house looks like a runway, so... Detmers and Terrain. <laughs> oh, I wish everybody, I wish, I wish if I could be king for one day, I would give Bailey and Abrams, I'd give everybody one auto, and then we would throw up five numbered, and that's what we'd chase throughout the case. And base, no, that is uh, no auto. Oh, it is. So, oh, yeah, we had the, the fuchsia. So, Brainer on the base auto. Erstad with a New York ink. There we go. Nice uh, Alcantara parallel. Of course, auto is nicer, but parallels make up for at least or put a little bit of uh, so another base auto not cheap so alcantara here on the fuchsia chrome 106 of 199 Last pack here, box number seven. So another base auto. So Sanchez, Kirby, and Stott on the Chrome. So we're gonna hopefully finish with a blitz of number parallel or autos. All right, on two. Box <laughs> Jim, we have not seen his auto. 
Um, like I said, we we went two weeks in a row pulling an Alex Bohm Rookie of the Year favorites auto. We've seen Carlson, uh, Tavares, Mountcastle, Jimenez. I feel like I'm still missing one too. Oh, Casey Mice. Vogel and Freeman on the Chromes. Xavier Edwards in the top 100. Chatham and Foscue. The Chromes. Bozlovich on the Chrome along with Matthew Thompson. Casey Mize, Rookie of the Year favorites. DL Hall, Laura on the Chrome. And purple. Marcus Smith saw the Texas and Andrew Vaughn and Nick York. So the auto switch sides. Eighty of fifty or two fifty on this one. You see the Texas, of course. Congrats for the Marcus Smith spot. So it is a number, but uh, in my opinion, not low enough. Larnick on the top 100, Peraza and Gilbert. Alvarez on the Futurist, Morel and Rodriguez. We still have only received one orange, and that was a uh, refractor. Joe Adele on the top 100. Callahan, Dax Fulton on the chromes. And here's our atomic and a sky blue. Oh, I already saw that. So Tahada. Josiah Gray on the Chrome and Adley on the Atomic. So as I said in the uh, team break we just had, so if there's one player on the rookie and it comes to on the uh, Tejada, we have hit, gosh, I want to say, well, we have not hit an orange. But I think we've hit every other color of him. 460 of 499. Again, sometimes some players, it just you, it seems you hit them, and then others you don't hit nothing of. We've got the uh, Yusha, I think, in the team break of him. Sanchez on the retro. Alvarez and DeVoe on the Chrome. Nick Gonzalez on the Positional Promise. Jordan Walker, Bo Naylor on the Chromes. And Jake Vogel, Purple Paper on the end. Eight of 250. Yeah, actually, Jason, that does. That's uh, 
last year I did get uh, a Tommy Edmond Father's Day blue, and he's he was wearing the uh, powder blue. That card is pretty pretty sweet looking card. Hancock, Davis, and Johnson on the Chrome. Nick Gonzalez on the Futurist. Casas and Alex Thomas on the Chrome. Uh, Jason, yes, Tops is very good. And also they're very good if on missed hits or anything like that. Bitsco and Volp, or at least on my experience. 2019 update I actually sent in. Um, I had a case of there were seven different uh, cards that had a, so, I mean, the whole entire case of those had to go, or on that, those numbers had to go back because of a uh, roller mark or a scratch all the way across, and they sent back every one of them. So, Garrett Mitchell. On the top hundred, Romo and Zamora on the Chrome. And so a purple refractor, Brandon Marsh on the front, and St. Louis, Jordan Walker. Ninety six of two fifty. First ad on the retro Robinson and Bishop on the Chromes. Detmers on the Futurist, Espino, and Amaya on the Chrome. You know, I actually, last year in a draft, a uh, draft I was missing, we ended up missing two total autos, and I did tell them uh, they, they're they more than welcome to, uh, and I gave them the date, the video, and a link um, if they didn't uh, believe it. I, who knows? I don't think they probably do, but... Uh, Rays, Garrett Mitchell, Austin Hendrick... Last few packs here. So we did get a purple auto. That was the box of purples. Got a purple refractor along with a purple auto. Shoemake and Cower on the chrome. So there we go. There's a orange. And that is a top hundred. So and that is a glove. I'm trying to think of who has the AJ Puck. So nice hit for the AJ Puck spot. Jones and Henderson. 
that is the reason why we still have the, I, I was asked a couple weeks ago, why in the world do we have AJ Puck in if he doesn't have an auto or base? Um, unlike the unlike the talent pipeline where you would be hoping for a parallel to split, um, he still has some nice parallels available. So 19 of 25, so. That's our second orange so far. Javier on the Rookie of the Year favorites. Blade Alcantara on the Chrome. So, all right, on to box nine. Well, Mike, and you know, we don't charge admissions, so even if we break every Thursday night, we will have a, a off week in uh, second week of July. But uh, we do break every Thursday night. Something ended on Wednesdays. Sometimes it's may not be uh, your cup of tea, but I always I watch breaks. I drive a lot for work. Jordan Walker and Salas anymore. The radio is uh, seems redundant, so I watch breaks. Also, that's I'm learning. I watch a lot of different people just to learn, just to see how what different people do. And of course, I do join. So, Erstad, positional promise. Naylor Davis on the Chromes. There's an Austin Martin paper. Austin Hendrick, top 100, Casas and De La Rosa, and there's a De La Rosa paper right behind it. And orange, orange shimmer on the prospect, so. Austin Hendrick on the Futurist, Alex Thomas on the in Chicago White Sox, Dahlquist. So a orange shimmer prospect parallel along with a true orange. So we got a orange top 100. That one is 15 of 25, like a little boy. Well, I guess he is 21, but he doesn't look 21. No matter, I'm just getting that much older. Six toe on the Rookie of the Year favorites, Bitsko and Young. Uh, there is, there's actually no case hit in a uh, hobby, and there's no case hit either in, in uh, Jumbo, or like a real case hit. Um, you know, last year the case hit pretty much was a rookie auto. This year that's not so much the case. Um, draft had a case hit. That was a... Uh, a 2020 auto, I think, 20 and 20. So we're getting ready to go into Finest. So Finest usually has a case hit. Martian Robinson on the Chrome. Luis Robert on the Retro. Vogel and Cruz on the Chrome. Just need a couple real nice value hits. Just uh, we've been plugging along with decent color, decent uh, on the, especially on the parallels. Um, I would say as a value standpoint, 
I don't know if it's been there compared to some of our other cases, but that's just an upside down. I, I see that when I'm skimming by. I think of that's the blaze. DL Hall on the top hundred. Gray and green on the chromes. It's an upside down Maya. Those are atomic for the box. Alvarez on the chrome and LA Dodgers. Cody Hosey. Yeah, Mike, and our first break of the year, I can say we were we were just pacing along nice, and then uh, we ended with a blaze gold shimmer. Last week, I think it was our first box. We started with a, uh, a Costa gold shimmer, so... <clears throat> And Spackle, Angels, Alexander Ramirez. So we got his base. Oh, that was, must have been a stay parallel. <laughs> So again, uh, got a spackle, our second spackle. So it's a, it is a numbered, but uh, still really hoping we get a gold or lower. Twenty one of two ninety nine for the Ramirez spot. <laughs> okay, Eric, we'll. Uh... Mena was another one that we hit uh, first couple weeks, and then. Uh, we haven't seen him since either. Espino and Xavier Edwards. So, we have three boxes left. We're probably going to get one or two base autos. So, I don't want to uh, Luciano on the top hundred, Blade and Stott. And yellow prospect paper and are on the back with a Fuchsia shimmer in the middle. Philadelphia. Casey Martin. That one is number 20 of 199. And then the yellow paper, Toronto. There we go. No, it's not an auto, but this is a lower end or on the parallel side. That is our first parallel of Austin Martin. Number to 75 on the paper. 9 of 75. Jimenez on the Rookie of the Year favorites. Rutledge and Montero. Yeah, Mike. Last week, our uh, our first box was a orange, um, a orange Torkelson um, uh, top hundred, and then the Acosta, uh, the Acosta 
gold shimmer, and then I think it was a blaze blue, I think. Aaron Judge on the retro. Shoemake or Abrams, or I might be getting the weeks messed up, but I know it. The last last week the box was our first box out of the shoot was. Man, if I could only have bought that box for personal. Mariners pipeline, Nolan Jones and Henderson on the Chrome. Zach Veen on the Futurist. Freeman and Chatham on the Chrome. Bryson Stott on the Top 100. Bolzovich and Mena on the Chrome. Matthew Thompson and D.L. Hall on the Chrome. Last pack, box nine. Ryan Mountcastle on the Rookie of the Year favorites. Andrew Vaughn and Maiton on the Chrome. So. Yeah, and out of all the, the breaks I've joined and what we've opened, I haven't seen a gold nugget. I did a uh, half team break uh, a couple weeks ago, and somebody pulled a buyback. So that was a little bit of jealousy, but also it's cool. Cool when you see it because you you just know the odds and so here we go box number ten. Uh no, we haven't seen him since week one. I know that doesn't that's not good news, but there's always time to. There's a Torkelson on the atomic. Torkelson on the Atomic Refractor. Tatis on the Retro. Dominguez and Alcantara on the Chrome. Dominguez on the positional promise. Nick Lofton and Amaya on the chromes. And Josh Young on the fuchsia paper. Numbered to 293 of 299. Lynch, Whitley, and Diaz. Well, Mike, and you know the, I guess the one thing about this year in tops and the, with the 70 years, um, it seems their Hall of Famers or their, their auto for veterans was kind of increased. Um, kind of takes me back of, you know, being a kid. 
you know, and then this year too, they are going to have a chrome. I don't know if anybody has seen this, but they are going to have a chrome celebration, and the checklist is a 300 player checklist of all um, current and retired uh, eight, uh, Hall of Famers. Um, so that will be, I think, a lot of fun just because of, I'm sure, the checklist of autos and that will be pretty big. So, yeah. Aqua Shimmer coming up. Adley and Chicago White Sox. Gilbert. 54 of 125. Aqua Shimmer became my second favorite card behind the True Blue, which we had not seen a True Blue tonight. Dominguez on the top 100, India and Cavalli on the chrome. Miller and Poussin on the chromes. So I'll tell you, I mean, I really like the retro this year. The only thing is, is finding one on the centering has been, uh, that's a different story. But I, I really like that card. It just pops, especially the pair, some of the parallels. Bobby Witt on the Futurist. Abel and Ed Howard on the Chromes. Ramos. Riley Green and Cower on the Chromes. Rang and Patrick Bailey on the chromes. Casey Mize, Rookie of the Year favorites. Erstad and Garcia on the chromes. You know, Mike, I I can tell you that uh, I do like heritage for the uh, for the variations, and so here we go, orange or yellow. I thought maybe it was going to be a rookie, but it's not. But a, a yellow. But uh, yeah, on the on heritage this year, just it it got overly dull. So, New York Mets, Indy, Rodriguez, so 59 of 75 on that one. I do hope we still get one lower. We did get a yellow prospect parallel, and now I'll say auto. So <laughs> I we are actually going to do some Allen and Ginter this year and and uh it's going to be it's going to be interesting but uh um is uh yeah with with the way that uh, allocations and everything so we're 
we are taking some stuff that we haven't done in the past and it's just to try to try to build and so we are going to do allen and ginter um, regular and chrome so um, it will be an experience so if you guys want to see probably somebody that's going to fumble and everything else uh, that's going to be me this year on allen and ginter but again though you have to you kind of have to take anymore it's some stuff that uh you know we all can't just get bowman and and tops and all that um, hunter green and wander i guess we really backed off on gypsy this year just because if, when the gypsy was originally coming out we were going to be gone and then they pushed back the date all the way. And so that's kind of Austin Wells and Ramos. I can't, uh, Gypsy, along with Topps Chrome's checklist, is just on the rookies, is probably going to be uh, a lot of fun this year. Casey Mize in the top 100. Nick Gonzalez and Martin. Hancock and Morell on the Chromes. Yeah, we're gonna do uh, we're gonna do a little bit more. So last year we only did a couple cases of Heritage Minor. This year we're actually gonna do a couple or a little bit more of that, and then. Um, we did, we're going to do a little bit more uh, uh, pro debut too. Um, that was something that we really didn't get into last year. Baz and Langoliers. So last pack here, box 10. Sanchez, Detmers, and Manoa on the Chrome. So Rodriguez was the auto. Again, we're at three base autos, so I really hope we only get one more base. Um, on, otherwise, on the auto, so we did get the yellow, but other than that, it was the atomic and then two spackles, two refractors. So... Um, Kind of low or disappointing so far on the color in the auto. So, again, we'll do a recap at the end. D Dominguez on the Futurist, Lofton, Torkelson. Again, we do have a another one case on Jumbo. So. Kind of what we do do is we do two or three cases of different products, but also we do offer a one case, um, mainly just because, you know, uh, offer a cheaper um, to some people just because you could maybe bid on a spot that you normally can't afford. Um, that's why we do it. I mean, when it comes to time and my post in time and everything else, it it doesn't matter to me if I'm posting a two or three or whatever. Um, so, Bruhan and Rushman. So we we're gonna do. We have two more cases of jumbo. We're gonna break those in separate one cases. Um, we're gonna add in some finest. So um, India Rodriguez, and then that'll take us into. Uh, Series 2 launch, like I said, I, I think Series 2 will be a lot of fun, kind of along the lines of Series 1. Should have a nice rookie. Miller, Poussin, Blaze, haven't seen Blaze in a while.
Acuna, Trammell, and Eddie Diaz on the Chrome. Garrett Mitchell, Futurist, Dingler, and Rosario. Mauricio, Welker, and Reyes on the Chrome. Looks like a purple parallel, purple paper. It is a rookie, New York Mets, Clark Schmidt. And Brujan on, or Brujan, or whatever your cup of tea is on the pronunciation. So Jason, I don't know if you remember, but the one, uh, one top series one break, we hit a Clark Schmidt auto and do you remember that night on the chat didn't like that clark schmidt auto but every time i see him uh now i always think of that night i don't know if you remember that or not but 36 at 250 it was it was that case that uh, would i would say was probably probably the uh worst case out of all of it we had Yeah, we that was uh, Ruiz button in uh, Inception. I always I like the Inception button cards this year because they were um, they were to six, so there's only six buttons on a jersey. I thought was funny. Positional Promise, Riley Green and Tenna. Yeah, Mike, when uh, Jason mentioned earlier that uh, I've, I've helped try to educate him on Bowman, I was, I was explaining that to him that there's, you know, Bowman is more for prospects and you know, you would think as hard as it is to hit a rookie auto, they would carry that more value than they do, but they, they just don't. And that week we had pulled a Dylan Carlson gold shimmer and then a Blaze gold shimmer. So here we go. I was just saying we had not seen a true blue. So here comes a blue parallel. San Diego CJ. Nice CJ. Number 80 of 150. Uh, yeah, Sheila, I do believe we had a uh, decent parallel on Hunter Green. Yeah, yep, we had yeah, we had a gold shimmer. So, oops, there's the CJ. Garcia, I don't believe, I don't recall, but. Uh, yeah, on the uh, Hunter Green, there's the uh, Gold Shimmer Hunter Green, number 10 of 50. So congrats on that one. Perloff, Langoliers, and Choi on the Chrome. Red Sox, Pipeline, Hunter Green, Wells on the Chromes.
Zach Veen on the top 100. Ramos and Kalenic on the Chrome. Gonzalez and Emerson Hancock on the Chromes. Nate Pearson on the Rookie of the Year favorites. Morell and Mackenzie Gore on the Chromes. Futurist, Spencer Torkelson, Mauricio, Bobby Witt. Casey Mize on the retro. Matt Manning and Davidson on the chromes. Should be getting our auto here. Detmers and Terang on the chrome. Joey Bart, Rookie of the Year favorites. Bailey and Beard on the chrome. I think that might be the in the auto. So we can guess it, save it to the last pack. Yep. Nolan Jones, Woods Richardson, and Groshans on the Chromes. All right, should be our auto. It is a base auto. Washington. Clough, have not seen that one, so, and just be aware, so, that's been our worst one, you can see the, all the way across the tops. Erstad and Kirby, and Mauricio on the back side, sky blue parallel. Yeah, Eric, we need uh, 276 of 499. My confidence of having a gold or lower is uh, running thin. So again, on the uh, on the Clough Auto here, just be aware. Just across the top, some of that might. It doesn't look like it's too deep, so it may rub out. But uh, all the way across the top, there's lines so all right here we go box 12 so again do appreciate everybody again it's nice to hang out especially on the hobby it's you know two and a half hours usually of course the jumbos jumbos only take about an hour and a half about an hour and 35 minutes so again next week we do have the one case jumbo um I think that's all we are planning on doing. We were going to sneak in some finest next week, but uh, I'm just going to wait uh, for the following. So, shipping wise, again, we do credit back shipping on hit list spots. Also, um, we do at the end, we, we look at uh, the break and we try to invest back into the break. So, we try to help out where we can. Obviously, we can't uh, credit back spots, but uh, so. Be on the lookout for that, at least on the credit of the shipping back. And then we do try to, like I said, if it's not a percent off, it is at least a coupon for a future break with a percent off. Um, we have uh, found over the last couple of years since we've been doing this that, you know, we've tried free goods. We've tried uh, several different things. It seems uh, money is the thing that's appreciated the best. So 
I do send a message out on that. So again, this year with Bowman, or you know, last year the Bowman, especially in draft, got away from just the auto only spots. Um, this year it seems we've uh, gone back to quite a few auto only spots. One thing also to always know is uh, to get off the screen on our screen on our end, you do have to show it as shipped, even though something isn't shipped. So, rookie of the year favorites, Royce Lewis and Bishop. I don't know if some of you have noticed. Some people start including that you will receive a autograph index card or something. Um, that's just because I can tell you that uh, there's there's ways around um, getting a credit back, and uh, unfortunately, oh there we go. It's a base auto, but it is a it's a nice base auto. So Alcantara takes down and the not so much effort signature. Garrett Mitchell gets the penmanship award this year, but uh, he definitely gets the lack of effort. So. It was a base auto, so kind of frustrating on the color um, for the auto side. So we finished five and seven on five base to 200 of 299 on the Freddie Nova. So Alcantara did get the, uh, I think it was the pink fuchsia earlier, or I know we got a parallel. All right, so let's hope for another decent color on a parallel. There's no reason why we couldn't get a red. Belzovich and Feliciano and Foscu, so again, do apologize for a lot of the spots that did not hit. That is the risk with only doing a one case, but also at the same time, you know, next week we will have 24 autos available. But uh, also, it's a it's a a lesser dollar amount of the risk. Wow. Yeah, those those are nice to hit. Um, uh, Chris on the Altuve, uh, no parallels on Altuve. Patino on the top hundred, Jeter Downs and Vavra on the Chrome. Just base. And here comes a pink fuchsia. Rookie, Boston Red Sox, Tanner Hope. Pena, and then Sanchez. What's the third Sanchez parallel? Thirty-five of two ninety-nine. Well, believe it or not, I did, and, you know, this year I would say breaking or people joining breaks has been, uh, you always know by the tone or the messages we get, um, they didn't know what they're getting into, but I actually did receive a message once this year, somebody asking if they got, if, if they paid for the spot after the break. And I, I, I really bit my tongue on answering that because if that was the case and there wasn't no risk, I would, I would take five of those. Beater and Sabato. Yeah, Eric. Actually, it's so you know, we, so we post um, everything to end on a Wednesday night. It's currently up there right now. Um, so, again, if you. Um, we uh, we try to put a, a, 
a schedule out, um, but then that is, that's, we are so, you know, just like everybody else, so um, held on uh, release and pushbacks and everything else. So um, any wins, every Wednesday, um, we have something ending, and then we, we either repost for Wednesday for the following Wednesday, or you can do a Friday for Wednesday. So, well, that's currently up there now. I was going to post uh, for tomorrow night for to end also on Wednesday for the uh, uh, a uh, finest, but uh, with my work schedule and everything else. It's just, uh, it's just rushing to hurry up and do something. And Garcia on the rookie of the year favorites, Dahlquist and DeVoe. So this is the second week in a row that we have gone rookie hit list or auto, I should say. Um, and also, yes, even in our um, parallels, we did get a, in our team break earlier, we did get a um, Alex Bohm Aqua in the top 100, but... Luis, top 100, Walston and Ivan Johnson. The Chromes. Last few packs again. Do appreciate everybody, everybody's company, everybody's chat. Shipping wise, we will get these out. Um, like I said, ready to ship. Of course, with it being the holiday, we'll still have. Everybody will see an update probably on Sunday by Sunday. Well, and, and also, Eric, the, you know, what we're starting to find, and Carol and Jarvis, so there are some people and uh, that pretty basically they'll, they'll win spots, wait to pay, um, or they go hitless. There, I can tell you there is a, a Costa and Laura, there is a way that anybody could get out of more or less pain for a break, but, um, yeah, as I always say, and, you know, we, we like hearing, you know, the, the good, good messages and good email because, uh, believe it or not, in today's world, you don't make everybody happy, but everybody feels that you should make everybody happy, so, you know, Jason and I talked one week about and somebody, I guess, decided. But yeah, I I agree, wholeheartedly with your. Yeah, well, and also, I mean, so you know, we do credit back shipping, which there's a lot of people that don't do that. Um, there are times that uh, it's taken advantage of because if if I say if I say something is sent, all it takes is for you to say I didn't receive it, um, and then pretty basically I have to re refund. And and what's going to happen on that is eventually we can't afford to do that because you know we only have so much money to work with. Um, so you know I hope that it doesn't go to that where we just say okay we're no longer going to do that and we'll send out a index card um, because then for sure everybody's getting something but it takes away from the people that uh, understand so top 100 Zach Veen on the aqua so as the last parallel on the way out so
so yeah, so I mean, it's it's that thing of you know, um, you know, anybody can go in and and add up and everything else on what a and I can tell you, there's a lot more to this than just uh, some some nice lights and a camera and but uh, you know, you only have so much to work with. So anyway, so that is the end. So on to the recap. So we will start with the paper. So we will separate the base set from the prospects. So on to the base set. So the lowest number again, not uh, we got some nice color on the prospects, but uh, very disappointed. I mean, we we didn't get a gold. So the lowest number on our paper is yellow on the prospects and the um, so yeah, that's kind of kind of disappointing. So overall, a little bit disappointing. But uh, again, sometimes the odds are with us, and sometimes they are not. Um, uh, so yeah, that's. Uh, you know, a couple of weeks ago we had we were way ahead of the odds and uh, this week it seems uh, the odds weren't in our favor so sky blue number to 499 Tejada on the neon green number to 399 Alonzo the pink fuchsia number to 299 Yastrzemski and Hope the purple number to 250 Clark Schmidt and uh, Josh Bell on the yellow number to 275 on to the prospects. So again, the lowest number was the yellow. It, it was the it was a good name. That's one thing to be thankful for. It's, you know, we are going to hit the color. It's just sometimes we want it to be certain numbers. But uh, uh, so on to the sky blue parallels number to four ninety nine Gomez. Mauricio, Neon Green, Nolan Jones, Detmers, Pink, Fuchsia, Josh Young, and Talia, Purple numbered to 250, Vogel, 150, Blue, Talia, and then the 75, Austin Martin. Again, that's the first parallel we have got of Martin. So on the... On the... Uh, Atomic refractors again one per hobby box next week. We'll see two per jumbo box Sanchez Brujan Torkelson Hosey Rushman India Cavaco Reyes Libitor Trammell Miller and Poussin And then on the chrome or the the prospect parallel so we did get decent color here we did get a orange and an orange shimmer also we did get a gold shimmer so again we had a nice uh, nice array of those um, so congrats on those hits just give me a second here All right. Okay, on the refractors, number to 499, JJ Blade, Kavako, and Brennan Davis. On the spackles, number to 299, Nova, Ivan Johnson, one purple, number to 250. Jordan Walker. On the fuchsias, we had two shimmers and one true. So 199, Perdomo, Martin, and then there is the Alcantara. One true blue, CJ Abrams. And then on the uh, two aqua shimmers, Talia, Sanchez, and then one mean or mini green diamond is a Cavaco. 75 on the yellow Bailey. And then the Gold Shimmer, Hunter Green, Feliciano, and then Dahlquist on the Orange Shimmer.
on the parallel, so we did get four parallels, an orange on those along with a gold. So on the atomic, Spencer Torkelson on the top 100. Zach Veen on the aqua number to 125. On the retro, Wander Franco. And then on the orange, AJ Puck on the top 100. On the base autos, so again, five base autos. We finished with the Alcantara, Clough, Bonacci, Encarnacion, and Mac Wainwright. And then on the numbered, our lowest number was a yellow, which that is frustrating. I know everybody's probably getting tired of hearing me say that, but uh, we do like the lower numbers coming out of the... Uh, Hobby. So on the refractors, number to 499, Montano, Thompson, and then two Spackles, Ramirez, Hancock, and then on the purple, Marcus Smith, Angel Martinez on the atomic, and then uh, Rodriguez on the yellow. So that is it. Again, do appreciate everybody. It was uh, fun. Hope everybody has a safe uh, Memorial Day, since it seems we are starting to get back to the norm. Everybody be safe this weekend and hope to see you all next week.